Let's now talk about the one of the most important and very efficient integration technology that is OData services. OData stands for Open Data Protocol. OData is an OIS standard that defines a protocol for building and consuming RESTful services based on HTTP protocol. In SAP, we can use OData services for inbound integration. We can use OData services for two purposes. One is to query the data from SAP. The other one is to perform, create, update and delete operations on SAP system. Let's now look at the communication components of OData services. In SAP, we start with the OData model. Then we generate an OData service on top of this OData model. Then this OData service can be exposed as an OData service to the external world. And we have an OData client that uses OData protocol to invoke the service in SAP system. OData model uses EDM stands for Entity Data Model. OData services uses message format like JSON or XML. It also supports URIs for request handling. You can access OData services from ABAP layer and HANA layer. In HANA, we can expose a CDS view as an OData service by simply adding an annotation at the rate OData. For more information, please check my other video on HTTP and REST integration. Let's now look into different scenarios where we can use OData services. We can use OData services for integrating SAP and SAP system or SAP and a non-SAP system. As you can see, it always works with request and response type of communication. In OData services integration, NetWeaver Gateway plays a very important role. It acts as a mediator between the client application and SAP system. OData Services uses HTTP-based REST protocol. For more information, please watch my other video on HTTP and REST integration. OData Services are very powerful and efficient for integrating with SAP system. It provides a built-in framework for monitoring of the services. Let's have a quick recap quiz. What is the T code for OData Services development? What is OData metadata composed of? Let me know your answers and feedback in the comment section. Thank you for watching.